men love to be respected and women we love to be loved so hello beautiful people how y'all doing today hope you guys are having a wonderful day again if you're new to this channel my name is barbara and i'm a us based cameroonian youtuber and if you're an oldie thank you so so much for coming back again i just finished filming this look so if you haven't seen that video make sure you check it out this is my everyday makeup routine so yeah i'm just gonna jump straight into the video i haven't done in a sit i haven't done a sit down video in quite a long time so i'm big so I haven't done a sit down video in quite a long time so I decided you know what I'm going to do more of sit down videos so I want to engage more into sit down videos but before I do that I want to tell you guys give you guys a little bit of life update things that I've been doing things that have been going on in my life so the first thing I'm gonna talk about of course if you didn't know I posted a video of my daughter's um DIY photo shoot that I did when they turn one so that's something that is big that happened recently they just turned one June 21st and they celebrated their birthday on June 29 it was amazing I had a house full like I had family over my sister and the husband came from Europe my, my sister from Maryland her husband and their two kids and also her brother-in-law and my mom I mean I had a house full it was amazing and also my little nephew from California was also here so I had a house full and I was so so busy I wanted to vlog I tried vlogging so I'm gonna check the footage if I don't have enough footage to install upload that as a vlog of its own i'm gonna insert clips so you guys can see because i was really really busy so i didn't have time to pick up the camera i gave my camera to my nephew to vlog you know so he didn't do quite a good job like if i was the one vlogging i'll make sure i capture clips because it's always good to capture those moments even if you don't use the footage but just have it so just in case you have to use it so yeah if i don't have enough footage of its own i'm gonna insert clips so another main Major thing I think I've already told you guys I'm still doing my internship so I had about 240 hours so I'm down to like one oh this is just giving me headache already you know I'm down to one something so I think I have about two more weeks to go so that's still something that is still going on I remember when I first started I used to like vlog daily but it took a toll on me and <laughs> It kind of became so boring so I'm like okay I'm showing you guys the same thing even though they are different outfits so I thought about it I'm like okay I'm gonna do like a five day a whole week like walk route <laughs> so I thought about it I'm like okay you know what I'm just gonna stop vlogging and I'm just gonna do a different thing different idea I'm gonna show you guys like a week works outfit like corporate work outfit yeah I said I was gonna show you guys that but I haven't had the chance to film that video so yeah but look out for that video i'm gonna film that so i'm still doing the internship i can't wait to finish so another life update currently while i'm filming this video my husband he just left for california today he left for california today he's gonna be there for a week for training and my sister that came from europe because my sister from maryland and my mom they left I think on Tuesday after the birthday which was on Saturday and my sister from Europe left today with her husband and her son they're going to California because this is their first time in the United States so they're going to see where their son lives because he came from Europe to school in California so yeah so they're gonna go there and they're gonna come back here before going back to Maryland so I'm gonna see them again like after everybody left the house has just been so quiet I'm just here with the four kids and I miss my husband he was here I mean everybody's just living like the same time you know cherish the people around you I'm gonna say that because I mean when they are not there it's like a whole vacant space like in my heart it's just so empty i love my family so so much i love them so much i like a house full even my son jason like he didn't want anybody to leave he loves when we have guests he loves when we have guests so yeah i love my family so much i just feel so i'm just home with the kids nothing to do so i'm just like you know what 
the girls are sleeping i'm just gonna film some videos you know so I keep myself busy but deep inside me i'm kind of lonely like even though i have my kids but i just miss my husband because he don't travel that often you know we always as a family i'm gonna get emotional right now yeah cherish the people around you i'm just gonna say that you know cherish people make them feel loved you know because when they are not there you're gonna miss them you know appreciate them so i always appreciate my husband but like now that he's gone i just feel so empty because he's like uh, anyways that's not why i'm making this video so i'm just giving you guys live updates so yeah let's see what else uh, do i want to update you guys about so I'm just gonna touch a little bit about the girls. They they're not walking yet, and yeah, they're not walking yet. <laughs> I know the girls are not walking yet. Every every kid is different, and remember, they came premature a little bit. They were born before their time, and normally twins are born early. They normally were supposed to be born like 37 weeks, but they came before 37 weeks, so they were considered premature. But my babies are doing great. I know they're gonna walk soon. I'm not worried. I'm not rushing them. So they're taking their time. I know they're gonna do it. So yeah that's just update but they are eating so so well especially Haley. Haley can eat for africa she took over mama because you know i'm a foodie i love food so my baby eats really really good and they are so independent they try to do stuff on their own they want to eat by themselves they want to drink by themselves they are just go-getters you know they are just like me i just pray they talk over i just pray they take over me my energy my energy and just a go-getter just like getting things done you know I'm just trusting God because I just I'm just trusting God because I just want my mom is calling me I'll call her back I'm just trusting God because I just want to raise them the best way possible my mom I know she's gonna talk for long let me see hey mommy hello yes ma what's up I know right Ah. <laughs> yeah if you don't pack it if you don't pack it things then so yeah i'm just the rest just to get the me time you know <laughs> you don't go to church no i don't go to church i'll be tired so i'm like mm -hmm. i don't go to church how are you so <laughs> I was talking to my mom so another life update something i've been doing lately is reading books one of the books i've been reading is this book it says love and respect the love she most desire a marriage book with a difference so i'm just gonna read a little bit about the book discover the single sick discover the single greatest secret to a successful marriage psychology studies affirm it and the bible has been saying it for ages cracking the communication code between husband and wife involves understanding one thing that a condition unconditional respect is as powerful for him as unconditional love is for her men love to be respected and women we love to be loved so it's a secret to marriage that every couple seeks and yet few couples ever find so i've been reading this book it's amazing i love the book i'm not halfway gone yet i've had this book for some time over two years but i've never read it so i love buying good books and just keep it and when i'm ready to read it it's at my disposal and i can read it at any time so since i've been doing internship and it kind of got a little boring so because i mean everything that they wanted to teach me i've learned it already so i'm just doing like routines so i have a bit of spare time so i take books with me and i read it while i have free time at work so this is amazing like marriage is not something that is written in a book but you have to understand some things like a school is like a continuous learning process it's like a ministry so you just have to understand your partner understand i mean putting god first is the number one thing i advise every couple because that helps a whole lot in a marriage it helps a whole lot yeah so that has helped me a lot my peace my sanity it comes from god not even from my husband it just my husband is just like 
someone that complements that which I already have because prior to me like five years ago I would say oh I seek that love and peace and sanity from men or from a man and it failed me but ever since I changed my direction I've always been a God lover but I was seeking that peace that happiness from a man but ever since I redirected that towards God I discovered that everything the peace the love everything I ever want will come from God so and God will use men to give me that so but the number one thing is for me to seek it from God first to be close to God first so I'm very very proud my fears are gone I mean I live I'm just so proud of who I am today like everything my peace no matter what I'm facing no matter what I'm going through I just find this happiness I don't know where it comes from but I'm just always happy like you will never catch me being sad or maybe I'll have a little moment of a two second sadness moment but I'll bounce back real quick at the moment I just snap back and be like oh Bobby what are you doing your father in heaven you know everything I just know that everything happened for a reason and they work together for my good for my good even the Bible says that so yeah ever since I redirected my focus and seek everything from God cast my burden onto him like everything has been perfect I don't seek love everything all those things from men I know God will use them to give it to me but first I seek it from God and my life has been awesome it's been great so yeah just keeping my life I just love my peace one thing I love is my peace my sanity I love that I love that and I don't want anybody nobody the more the, the place in which I am now in my life nobody can take that away you can't take away my love my happiness my joy anything you know you can't take away that from me what God says will be will be you know if it's mine it will be I will attain my destiny I will get there it will be delayed but it will never be taken away from me so yeah so yeah those are just the updates what else do I want to update you guys about okay my son my oldest son he'll be going to Maryland for vacation he's going to see his uncle if you don't know if you're new to this channel and you didn't know I had a son prior to getting married if you don't know, I had a son from a previous relationship before getting married to my now husband. So my son is going to see his uncle. He's gone for vacation. He's going to be there for at least, I think, two weeks or less, like two weeks. So he'll be leaving in a week's time. So yeah, I want him to go see his cousins. And I know he's going to have fun. He needs that time so he can come back with a fresh mind. You know, he can have stuff to tell his friends when he go back to school. Like what he did for the summer vacation. Yeah, even though we've done stuff, you know, he had family over. We did a lot of stuff, took them to the water play, you know. So yeah, but he'll be gone. We're going to miss him so much. And I know he's going to miss us. He's going to miss us, especially the girls. Yeah, so that's another update that is coming up. So so i think that's it i think that's all i wanted to update you guys about so hope you guys did enjoy this video so moving forward i'm gonna be doing sit down videos and incorporate some vlogs into e2 yeah so i just wanted to give you guys like updates you know about what has been going on in my life you know where i'm at now stuff like that but hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did please leave a comment down below if you have any questions leave a comment down below make sure you thumbs up this video if you did enjoy it and if you haven't subscribed to this channel what are you waiting for please join the Bobby squad appreciate you guys so much for all your love and support and without much further ado i'll see you guys in my next video bye